Hello everyone, thank you so much for stopping by. My name is Nike and this is Cook with Nike. On today's menu, we are making watermelon and a pineapple drink. This is so, so refreshing and so healthy. Let's get started. So I have my watermelon here. This is really big as you can see and I'm not going to use all of it. I'm just going to use half of it. It's the watermelon season when you go to the store, there's a lot of watermelon in the store and this was actually a gift for one of my mothers my sarah thank you so much for this watermelon it was so good and i loved it really really juicy it was really perfect for this juice all i'm doing right now is just cutting the watermelon and just taking the fruit out i also like to use a spoon to take um the rest of the fruit um you see how watermelon is shaped when you cut them it's really hard to use the knife um, to take all the food out so the spoon is really helpful when I use it this way. And this is my um, watermelon, everything is cut. Uh, the rest of it, I cut them and I put them in my refrigerator and I'm going to be eating them as a uh, snack. And I have my pineapple, I'm using the whole pineapple for this recipe. When you're peeling your um, pineapple for any recipe, you want to take your time and peel it really well. You see all that like brownish dots in there, you really want to take them out. But if you don't take care, you might also like take a lot of pineapple and put it in garbage. But just take your time and just cut it to make sure all that um, brownish dot is not on it before you consume it. Watermelon and pineapple has a lot of good health benefit, uh, like with most um, fruit. If you Google it, it's going to list all the um, benefits. When I was reading the health benefit for pineapple and watermelon, both of them had a um, lot of things in common, like with the health benefit. But one thing that caught my attention was, uh, it says it was really, really good for men and women. Yes, really, really good for men and women. So yeah, that's all I got to say. So I'm done cutting my watermelon and my pineapple and it's ready. All I have to do right now is just um, put in my blender and just blend it. If you have a juicer, good for you. Just put in the juicer and you're ready to go. But if you don't have one, um, just do it this way. Just put it in your blender and we're going to strain it after this. Remember, I did not add any water to the blender because the watermelon is all juicy. Like it has a lot of, lot of liquid in it. Really juicy. So you don't need any water when you're blending your watermelon with other fruit okay so yeah i'm gonna blend everything together and we're gonna um, strain this and this is how it looks after you blend everything together uh, you could have it this way it's like um smoothie and it has all the chop and everything in it so yeah but i want mine like in a drink form like refresher and really light so i'm going to use my cheesecloth to um strain everything and take the chop off if you don't have a, a cheesecloth you could use extra fine um, strainer and I think that should be okay to to do it but if you have a cheesecloth use that it just take everything all the chop off and it makes your juice really really light and this is how it looks the chop I'm gonna discard that I don't need that and yeah I'm gonna do this till I'm done straining all my juice And this is how it looks see how light that is yeah this is all from the watermelon and uh, pineapple no water added this is from its own juice yep and uh, for me on top is from straining it and also when you blend it that's how um, you get it but it's okay if you can keep it that's fine but I just don't like the foam on top so I'm just using my strainer to take it out but if you love it just keep it on top that is okay 
I'm going to be adding two lemon um, to my drink. It just brings a kick to it, especially when it's hot like this. If you have something citrusy, it just tastes so good. But if you don't like it, you don't have to. But if you do, please add it and trust me, you will love this. So yeah, I'm adding my um, lemon juice to it. As you see, I strain it. But if you love the pop, hey, go ahead and just squeeze everything in your juice. And our watermelon and pineapple drink is ready. This was so good. Perfect for the summer and so, so healthy. Everything was all natural. No water added, no sugar added. The sweetness went from the watermelon and the pineapple and it was so good. Add this to your summer drinks and trust me, you will love this. All right, everybody. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you learned something new. I hope you give this recipe a try and I know you will love it. Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't. It helps me out a lot and I appreciate that so much. And give me a thumbs up if you love this video. Until I come your way next time, this is Cook with Nike. Be good to yourself. Be good to everyone. It goes a long way.